AEW World Women's Champion Hikaru Shida is joining me right here on the show. How are you today? Good, thank you. Thank you so much for taking the time. Thank you for inviting me. Of course. Now we are just days away from you being in an intense, wild match, not only for AEW at All In, but at Wembley Stadium. I've heard you going around today with all the other interviews and everyone's mentioning 80,000 people. And every time it's mentioned, that is the face I love seeing it. You just light up because the number is just absolutely crazy so has that aspect sunk in with you yet yeah it's too crazy for me i i can't imagine how i see the fan and fan how fans see me i it's gonna be like a maybe like little ants yeah yeah <laughs> <laughs> that. Oh. Do you think when you get out there and once you're going down that ramp, making your way in your entrance, that you're going to like be able to actually take a moment to soak it in, or do you think it'll be once you're done wrestling that it'll hit you how massive this actually is for you? It's going to be a long walk, right? <laughs> huh. And I just realized two days ago, and oh yeah, the ramp is so long, so I need something special for my entrance so <laughs> do you know what it is yet i i okay i'm making my gear everything so right. entrance gear too so yesterday i just finished oh my god entrance yeah so that's cutting it close were you worried at all or oh my goodness <laughs> Well, there you had mentioned making your own gear, and there was this adorable photo you posted with yourself sewing and your cat Ruda. So I wanted to ask, how how are they doing? Before we get into the rest of things, yeah, she's she's my she's my boss. So like, um, she's watching everything okay or everything safe. Yeah, <laughs> that's crazy. But yeah, she. She just wants my attention. She's your little baby, right? Yeah, yeah. she is. <laughs> well, how long have you been making your own gear for now? Do you find that you like making it for most of the events? Uh, yeah, since I came to the United States, I made... Yeah, I made almost everything. Wow. Yeah. That's impressive. I Thank can't you. I can't sew at all. So anytime <laughs> I see anytime I know someone can sew in general, that's impressive to me. But the fact you're making these intricate body suits and two peat like it's it's wild. Wild. <laughs> it's it's very good for the concentration and it's kind of like a for me it's meditation. Okay. Yeah. You think about the match and think about how I wrestle with this gear. So yeah, it's really good for consideration, yeah. Well, other than that kind of bringing you a little bit of just solace in your mental state and the meditation aspect, mm -hmm. what are some other things in your life that are able to bring you that kind of feeling? Does anything else make you feel like you're meditating? Mm, actually, I always, I always listen to same music before the match. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's just Japanese anime song, but yeah, that makes me more like a confident, okay, let's go, feeling, yeah. <laughs> which, which song is it, just for everyone who is into anime who might be watching? Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's called Revenge Game. Revenge from, Game. Yeah, Honeyworks. Okay. Yeah, but it's so good. <laughs> I can see it on your face yeah. when you say it, you yeah. love this song. I think it's from uh, Haikyuu. Anime is okay. Called, uh, yeah, Haikyuu. Or it's, yeah, it's anime of variable. So. Well, we're talking about what's to come and what's in the future, of course, when it comes to this title defense. But I wanted to go back to the beginning of this journey a little bit because a big part of it, when it comes to your wrestling, started with you portraying a wrestler in a movie, and now that you are actually doing it, what a crazy! I don't, I'm, it's kind of <laughs> insane to say 180, but I guess 360 in a sense. Um, so, was there anything when you were training to actually do the real thing that struck you as a lot harder? Anything you maybe yeah. didn't? Yeah. So, what were some of the those things. Yes, but yeah, actually I plan I quit for a year. So like a, I quit this date, I wanna wrestle with with this guy, I this guy on the last match and after that I I watched the movie and wrestling made me more 
shiny, and I I felt I I should I should keep doing this. I need wrestling in my life. Wow! I just felt so so. Yeah, and it's 15 years now. So. That's amazing. Do you feel like if you never did that film, you maybe wouldn't have ever got into wrestling? Like, is that film the main? Actually, I didn't know what is professional wrestling. Until that Before, movie? Yeah. Wow. So when I started training, actually, I was, I was like, what am I doing? <laughs> <laughs> the movie literally yeah. changed the course of the next 15 years of your life, which you would have never thought when you first got yes. that role. That's right. That's it's right. It's incredible. Yeah. <laughs> we talked about the championship, your adorable kitty, so I wanted to bring up something else I know you love outside of those two, and that's video games. So when it comes to Fight Forever, tell me about the moment you first saw yourself in video game form. So, that's one of my dreams, so, and it looks like so good, and yeah. Actually, I saw the trailer, like uh, with Jericho and Kenny and me, was in the first trailer, I think, and the falcon arrow is so me. <laughs> that looks so me. <laughs> so I'm so excited, yeah. It's your dream come true. Yes, yes. Well, for the last question here, I was wondering, the ultimate video game in your eyes, what is it? The best video game of all time. Yes. It's not that easy, I know. Uh, yeah, I, I love Legend of Zelda series. Oh, it's one of my favorites. Really? Oh my gosh, I used to play yeah. it for hours upon hours every day as a kid. Yeah, the, the Tears of the Kingdom, I played 20 hours in a day. Oh my gosh. I mean, I don't blame you though. I've done that with a lot of different games. Yeah. yeah. That was the best, I think, yeah. <laughs> You're reminiscing, thinking those were good times. Yeah. That was a good day. <laughs> Well, I want to say thank you so much for sitting with me today. Best of luck this Sunday at Wembley Stadium defending you. your title. And thank you again. It's been thank an absolute you. pleasure. And to everybody watching, be sure to hit up aliciatoot.com for more exclusive interviews and features. We'll see you next time. We'll